Hello guys, so welcome to another video. So as promised, I thought I'll do a video about the Porsche 911 GT3 RS, uh, which we got from the Fozathon shop. Uh, so yeah, you can get it from the Fozathon shop now. It's worth 750, so you need a lot of points. Uh, but hopefully, if you have been following my series, you might have enough points to get this car. Uh, yeah, so. We are already at 42% but let's put a hold on it for now or you know what, uh, let's build the Porsche and let's take it for some of these events. Hmm, I think that's not a bad idea at all but we'll have to see how that goes. So we'll go to festival. Then we'll go to the garage, upgrades and tuning, custom upgrade. So first and foremost, let's see what engine option do we have for this one. Uh, okay, the 3.8 liter twin turbo. Is it from, I think it's from the Porsche 918. <coughs> yeah. So this engine, it's a little bit heavy, but it provides a lot more power. So I think we'll be get going with this one. Uh, yep, let's go with this one. Let's make it all wheel drive because we are going to need it since it is winters. Uh, you know what, let's see how much power we can get out of this engine. I don't want to make it an X-Class car, I want to keep it S2-998 maybe. Okay, so 1111 horsepower. Uh, let's change the tires, give it snow tires, yes, uh, because that will decrease the PI. Uh, I think I'll keep the front tires the same for now. But I am going to upgrade the rear tires. Yep. Uh, let's do this one. So we are at 984. We need to upgrade. Uh, I think I'll keep it stock because we don't need the rally suspension for now. The weight reduction will put us exactly at 998. Uh, so we'll come back to that. Let's come back to that. Uh, the clutch, yep. We need to upgrade the clutch. Mm. This is only going to reduce the weight. We'll come back to the drive line as well. This is pretty much all done. If we do that, it increases the PI and it decreases the stats. So, I don't think I'm going to touch that for now. The arrow, yeah. Okay, if we upgrade the arrow, it increases our PI a lot. What about this one? I think this is fine. It increases our stats quite a bit but it in, does not increase our PI that much. Uh, what are we saving for? I forgot. Yeah, we're saving for the weight reduction, right? Yeah. F2998. Uh, can we get the front splitter? No, we cannot. So, what else is left? Can we change the rims? and get something which will put us at S998 I want something which can put us at maybe 996 yes that is perfect uh, I think I'll decrease yeah 996 this looks fine now maybe just maybe we can get the front splitter can we? nope no we cannot okay so all this is upgraded right let me just check once more 
so this is all upgraded I think yep all this is fully upgraded the brakes yeah the weight reduction can we get the weight reduction oh we already have the weight reduction here uh, what weight do we add we are at almost 3000 pounds uh, but I think the power is quite good the power is really good uh, is there anything which is left maybe we can upgrade the drive line yeah because yeah why not uh, I don't think I can do anything else I can increase this but that's not going to have any difference uh, I think I really want to get the front bumper <coughs> but uh, we might have to let it go because it will put us at S X class uh, so I think I'm going to change the tires back and I'll, I'll get something different which is for 998 15 pounds 998 and 15 pounds okay Something with 998 and 15 pounds, okay. Fifteen pounds, fifteen pounds. But they don't look as pretty. Hmm, we can go for this one maybe. Or what else? We'll go with this one for now. And we'll see if there's something which is good for our car. Nope. I don't think there is. So most of the one, most of these car alloys which I like, is going to make it. This one looks pretty good. Let's just pick, check out special lift rims for now. You might have something good here. This looks really good as well. Yep, I think that's fine. Uh, everything is fully upgraded. Let me just see the stats once more. Yep, exactly 3000 pounds and trip double one double one horsepower yep i like the stats 134,000. that's an expensive one is there any race uh in this festival playlist where we can use the gt3 hours except the trial i don't want to do the trial uh Yep, for the trial we need, uh, okay, we should have got the type D auto union because it's worth 10 million. Okay. Uh, what is this? The showcase remix. We'll get back to it. Uh, winter games. Yes, these are all PF stunts. But these are the BF stunts which we can do with the car. Uh, for this one, we have to use an SUV. Maybe the Urus concept. I think I'll use the Urus for that one. And uh, yeah, I'll, as I figured, like there's nothing which lets us use the Porsche which we want to use. Uh, Extreme Off Road Championship. Okay, you can only use the Polaris RJ Anderson 2016 truck. Uh, so, I guess we cannot do that, but we can do the danger sign, we can do all the PF stunts. Let's start with a simple 
it's pre trap yeah uh i think we'll fast travel here we need to go here first we need to get out of the we are already out here uh, let's go here We have a fast car, so it should be pretty interesting. The gears are a little bit shorter than I would like, but uh, let's see what kind of speed can it get. Two hundred and twenty-seven, and a new person best for me. How much do we need for the season one? Two thirty-five. Okay. Uh, so what we'll do? We'll extend the gearing a little bit, because yeah, as you can see, that's the problem. We can only go to two three six. Two sixty-eight. Yep, I think I'll keep it here. This looks nice. Uh, let's just try it one more time. We'll fast travel here. And we'll see if we can beat that. We got really close on the first try. It was not a perfect one. Yeah, now the gearing is a lot better. So I need to make sure that I, that I do not hit anything. Okay, I have to be careful of the train. I'm just going to let the train pass. Yep. 223 we are actually slower we are actually slower could it be that we need the race tires I'm just going to try it one more time and this time I'm going to try from this side Maybe that's going to help. Turn around when it is safe to do so. Because this road it's absolutely dry and clean. So the snow tires are actually a disadvantage on the roads which are dry and clean. I think I think we need to carry a bit more speed through these corners. Nah, I don't think we're going to make it. Two hundred. Turn around when it is safe to do so. Two twenty-three. Again. You know what? Let's use a different car. Let's use a different car for now and uh, I really want to get this right. Mm, which car? I think we need to use the Mosler. Mosler is the one which can do it. Mosler should be the one to do it. I'm going to go here and try to see if the Mosler can do it. We need 235 and I think Mosler is definitely the one which stands a really good chance to do it. It has the down force, it has the acceleration, it has the top speed, it does not have the handling quite so much but uh, So 
Look at the speedometer go. 180, 200. Yep. We almost did it. We just need to let the train pass. Come on, train, pass. Nope. Why is this train not moving? Turn sharp right. Two hundred yards. Two thirty. Let's go back. Yep. Okay, so we need to let these notifications go. So we'll go back a little bit more. Two sixty two. There it is. Turn sharp right. Seasonal objective is complete, so now we'll get back to the Porsche. Yep, uh, so let's go and do another one. So this is the seasonal event, uh, 108 we need. Our personal best is 103. Let's see how it goes. We'll drive with the Porsche first. I think the fact that we don't have race tires is affecting the car. But doing the seasonal event is just the tip of the iceberg. Like, we also need. We need something which is usable in the races. Where did that truck come from? So, doing a good amount of speed. Brake. Can we actually wall ride that corner? You know what? I'm going to try to wall ride that corner. We have done the seasonal event, but I just want to see like what's the best we can do. So we need to do it smoothly, otherwise it's not going to be any good. Okay, let's try and see if we can get a better score by wall riding. So we go at really fast speed. Come on, come on, come on. Yes! 124. 124 miles per hour. We did we went a lot faster. We did really good. Okay. That's a lot. 317. Look at the difference between. But we are in the top 13%. Yep. That's fine. So the Porsche is good. Let's use the super speed spin which we just got. Yep. Pathetic. We have two wheel spins as well, so maybe something good? Nope. Really nothing at all from two wheel spins and one super wheel spin? Well, that's for the Horizon 4 for you. So, you know what? Let's ditch all this. We'll go and do some road races with it. Uh, 
Yep, let's do this one. The tune, can we make it a little bit better? Because the gearing, like... I want like... We are 268, maybe we can like go to 260. So, what... Uh, 2.04 and 4.3 so that is no good yep Can we make it two seconds flat? 2.39 Yes, let's keep it this for now. Looks fine to me. And uh, let's start the sprint race. I think it'll be an interesting one because we are going to finally be able to use the snow tires which we just got. We'll keep it expert. So it accelerates well. Hard to turn a little bit. Oh, the braking is not good. Yep, the brakes are no good. We missed the checkpoint, yes. Yeah. Yep. We missed the checkpoint. The car in front, it has insane acceleration. And the brakes are really good because every time he brakes and we brake, uh, and I brake, like. Yep. We keep ramming into him because his brakes are so much better than ours. With this car, uh, while turning, I have to feather the accelerator so that... What happened? Come on, turn. That was a good drift. Ultimate drift, yeah. So we are now in the handling section of the track. And there will be some low speed corners. I messed that one up really badly. I'm trying to drift the car. Nope. 
that's a good little drift. Uh, I wish it was not winter because this car it seems good but I don't know the downfall is it's not that great. Maybe it's because we are not using the front splitter. Could it be the that? Could it be like that's the reason? You know what? Let's downgrade the performance a little bit and get the front splitter because I think we'll add a little bit of weight to it. Uh, yeah, what am I doing? Yeah. So let's go to garage upgrades and tuning custom upgrade. We definitely need the front splitter, that's for sure. See, because that is going to help us with the handling and the braking. Uh, but now we need to remove something. Can we? Yeah, we can remove the weight reduction, but that puts us at S2993. Uh, is there something else which we can remove? The drive line, maybe? Yeah, but that's not making any difference. This is all standard stuff. Uh, how about we get alloys which can maybe help us a little bit. You know what, I cannot judge like this. So I have to first go back, see which alloys will do the trick for us. 997 is the lowest I've seen. Yep, 997 is definitely the lowest. So let's get 997, anything which is 997 and uh, looks good. Uh, let's get this one for now. Uh, and keep it stone tires. I'm definitely going to need that so what can I remove if I remove the weight reduction is too much like we increase the weight a lot I don't want to do that we can either remove some power maybe you know what first let's get the splitter And let's see what we can do to make it better. We are going to remove that. We are going to decrease the power a little bit. Not that one for sure. Yes, this puts us at S2998. can get this one the sport flywheel so we go down on power but uh, I think it should still be better uh, what about this one like does this have any effect nope nope this also does not affect our PI this does so I'm glad we did not change that uh there isn't a lot of stuff which we can do besides just downgrading the power yep is there anything else like which we can do this reduces the pi by two points and minus 17 horsepower so maybe nope we need to get this back. No, that's too much. Plus 37 horsepower. No. Can we do this? Like. Ten thirty and. <clears throat> okay, 18 horsepower. I need to see like 26. 
21, 28, 84, 20, 20 maybe. First, I think first and foremost, what is this doing? This is not adding any power, this is just reducing a bit a little bit. So let's do that. Uh, for the intercooler, it's just 14 horsepower deficit. But is everything else fully upgraded? Yeah. So this is not upgraded. So we are losing 38 horsepower there. 25 here. And 14 here. But yep, that's the compromise which we have to make. So how much horsepower do are we running? Yeah, I think I'm happy with this one. race but uh, I think if we do the same race again we'll get to know if this car is any better so I'm going to do the same race again and uh, I want to see if it's any better when it comes to downforce and handling because we have lesser power now so it should do the trick We also need to tune the car. I totally forgot. But the gearing, yeah, maybe we change the engine so like the engine components. So maybe we need 263. Yeah, so we are definitely less now. Uh, Yes, I think I'll keep it here. Apply current setup. Start the race. Let's see how it does. The front splitter should do the trick. Get out of my way. I don't know what car is at the first place. Braking is not good, it's still not good. Uh, but what about the high speed corners? Is it better or not? Is that a Bentley? I've also never driven a Bentley, I think, in this game. The upcoming section I will get to know about the front bit and is it doing its work or not. Yep, it's a section. Okay, so we are still going into the wall. Can I take this S curve? Yep, brilliantly. Get out of my way, please. It's still drifting around.
What was that? I think there's something. Yep, there's a rock there. Nice little drift going. And let's see how it fares in this section. Yeah, a lot better than the last thing. Not better than the last time. I don't remember the time, but uh, yeah, did good. Let's go and do a different race with this one because we have done the same race again and again. So, which one should we do? Let's do this one. I don't think I've done this one in a lot of time. Like it's been a while. So yeah. But will it let us use the Porsche? That's the question. Yep, we can use the Porsche. the race see how it fares the roads are a little bit better now because the snow is still there but it's like not too much it's just there's just freckles of snow yep that has helped us in our breaking a lot. So we're back to the thick snow. So we're back to breaking early. Did you see how much I had to break for that corner? in order to stay on the inside yep. it's just all over the place in this snow snow is too much I thought I got the checkpoint. No, I missed it. I missed it again. I need to go back. We're doing quite well, uh, but I'm not liking this snow, it's too much. Yep, this is more I like it. See, the brakes are really good on this car, but it's the snow, it's the snow which is affecting it a lot. A bit of a messy lap, but yeah, we finished well. I wish there was a way to change the weather, but uh, yeah, I'm. What I'm going to do, I have an idea. Uh, first, let's put the beach pin, yeah. Jaguar XJS, okay. Uh, 
I'll just upload the tune on the creator half, creator half for now. So this is the Winter S2 Road Race. Okay. I'll just put Best Winter S2 maybe. Yep. So it's best for speed, I would say. Yeah. Uh, no, it's not best for speed, I would say all around because you need a good all around for yeah. Sharing the file. Yeah, so this is saved. What I'll do, I'll go to the auto show, put rally suspension on, and uh, I'll change the tires to rally tires as well. We'll see what kind of power output we can get with that one, and we'll try to make a good rally car. So, upgrades and tuning, custom upgrade. Uh, Tires, yeah. Let's go with rally tires. Oh, we don't have rally tires. We just have drag tires. Let's take the snow ones because it is winter. But we are going to change the suspension. The springs, yeah. We get the rally springs. It does not make a lot of difference, you know. It just decreases our weight by one point. But uh, can we add any of the upgrades now? I don't think so, but we can just try, right? Nah. We cannot. We can just do this, maybe. Yep, that's it. That's the best we can do. So, we'll take this. We'll see how it fares when we take it rally racing. So, let's go and do a dirt race quickly. Because this is already a 42 minute video. Uh, world map. Dirt racing series. Let's go and do this one maybe. Yes, we can use the Porsche. White Horse Hill Trail. Okay. Uh, start the race. As usual, expert drive it up. And. Uh, let's see how it fares. I'm glad we're using the snow tires because I forgot, like in dirt sections, there will be snow. So. Yeah. The car is going a lot faster than I hoped. Is it the suspension? Okay, it's going well so far. Come on, keep it under control. So finally we are at the dirt section, we have the snow tires and we are, I think we are going to need it because it, the dirt section has snow as well, not too much but yep, the snow tires, I think it's a better bet. Finally, we are in the first place. We are back to the normal road. Look at the fog. Yep, we went. So it's a good car for dirt racing. I'll just quickly do one more dirt race to see, to just make sure it's a good car. 
Yes, let's do this one because I think this one it only had like around 50% of the dirt base. Uh, I want something which has more dirt sections. Yeah, and maybe there's a much amount of snow on a dirt section. Let's see. No, we cannot use the Porsche in this one. Uh, yeah, I remember this track. This section has a lot of dirt. It is almost completely dirt, you know. Uh, and I think it will let us use the Porsche as well, yeah. The car looks really good and green, you know. This, I like the color. I think it suits the car. Get out of my way. We are in the second place. We are on first place now. That was quick. In less than 10% we got to first place. I did not take that corner well. sections it's all snowy I think it's probably because we are in the mountains and the mountain generally they are cooler so there's a lot of snow over here so yeah I'm glad we kept the snow tires even for the dirt sections because this is completely snow cannot even see the road it's all snow I mean thank god for checkpoints otherwise we will not be even able to understand where we are going also having a hard time as well like only I think one of the AI is keeping up the other it's spread out that was a good drift we drifted almost the whole corner I'm using the handbrake a lot to move for these turns because the turns they're quite sharp and I don't want the car to hit the wall. So yeah, I'm using the handbrake and I'm drifting the car a lot. It's certainly not the fastest way, but yeah, it is definitely fun. It's really fast as well, like. It looks good. I like the car. I'm glad I spent my money and got this car. Wow, oh, what class is it? 998, right? Yeah. So, what I'll do, I'll upload this tune as well. Uh, save setup. Yeah. So, this one we have is the best winter S2. This is Winter Rally. We cannot type best, but we can do like something like this. Yep, that's a limit. So we'll do that. 
it's definitely an all round car I'll just type best winter valley s2 class share so yeah you guys have to tune now and uh, let me know if you guys like it before I go I should have done this before but at least just, let's just get this one but yeah uh, make sure if you guys like uh, like if you guys have the car or if you have enough points to get the car get the car so and after that try the tune which I've just created uh, I think it's a pretty good tune and uh, we have well over a thousand horsepower so and this car is really fun to drive like you can just pull the handbrake and drift and it is controllable like most as some of the other cars it, some of the other cars like they're not controllable and they go like this but this car is really good if you know how to drift uh like con taking control of the car yeah i think you're going to like it so that'll be it for this video and uh, i'll see you guys in the next one cheers